35 years after the B-2 struck fear into the world, America unveils a stealth bomber so advanced it makes that legend obsolete. Meet the B-21 Raider, a stealth aircraft with a radar signature the size of a mosquito, unmatched stealth capabilities, and a cost just one-third of its predecessor, the B-2, 2.2 billion per unit, the B-21 tart 6 and 92 million, and the knockout punch, while the B-2 excels at hiding from the front, the B-21 vanishes from every angle. China and Russia have poured billions into radar and missiles to counter American bombers. The B-21 just turned those systems into museum pieces. This isn't an upgrade, it's a revolution in stealth, driven by AI, optimized surfaces, next-generation materials, open architecture, and mission flexibility that rewrites the playbook. If you believe American innovation must always stay a generation ahead, stick around. This series will show why the B-21 doesn't just replace the B-2. It dominates for the next 50 years. The B-2 Spirit was a game changer in 1989, but its stealth worked best head on. In modern warfare, threats come from all directions. Multi, band radar, layered sensors, and AI tracking make the B-2 vulnerable from the sides and rear. The B-21 Raider obliterates that fatal flaw. Every curve, edge, and detail is simulated by supercomputers bending radar waves away from enemy receivers. Its radar cross section is likened to a mosquito, virtually untouchable. Try catching a mosquito in the dark with a flashlight. That's the experience for Chinese or Russian radar. With the B-21, America hasn't just extended stealth, it's perfected it. Many assume bigger planes mean more power. The B-2 boasts a massive 172-foot wingspan and carries up to 40,000 pounds of weapons. The B-21 is smaller, 132 feet and 20,000 pounds of payload. At first glance, it seems inferior, but in reality, it's a strategic masterstroke for the modern era. Why? Today's smart weapons are pinpoint accurate. A single guided missile can destroy what once required hundreds of dumb bombs. A smaller size reduces radar cross-section, lowers maintenance costs, and allows operations from shorter runways worldwide. In short, the B-21 trades raw bulk for precision, survivability, and flexibility qualities the B-2 can't match in the 21st century. When the B-2 Spirit debuted, the Soviet Union still existed, computers were rudimentary, and mobile phones were clunky bricks. Stealth was a mysterious concept, limited by primitive tools. Engineers relied on hand-drawn blueprints, scale models, and wind tunnels. That was genius for its time, but it was constrained by 1980s technology. The B-21 Raider is a child of the AI and quantum computing era. Supercomputers run millions of simulations to optimize every curve, bolt, and joint for maximum stealth. Advanced composites replace heavy, fragile coatings. The B-21's radar, absorbing skin, is lighter, tougher, and even self-healing. This isn't an improvement, it's a quantum leap. Comparing the B-2 to the B-21 is like comparing a rotary phone to a modern smartphone. The B-2 Spirit was infamous for its astronomical price tag. Planned for 132 units, only 21 were built, each costing $2.2 billion. Many nations' defense budgets couldn't afford a single one. Worse, its special materials required climate-controlled hangars, driving maintenance costs through the roof. The B-21 Raider rewrites that story. At roughly $692 million per unit, a third of the B-2's cost, the Air Force plans to acquire at least 100, spreading costs over a larger fleet. Not only cheaper to buy, the Raider is easier to maintain. Digital design, modular systems, and even 3D printed parts reduce repairs and downtime. This efficiency lets America deploy more aircraft faster without breaking the defense budget. The B-2 was built for one purpose, nuclear strikes on the Soviet Union. The B-21 Raider, however, is designed for 21st century multi-domain warfare. With a 4,000 mile range without refueling, it can strike anywhere on Earth from secure U.S. bases. But range is just the start. The B-21 can operate with or without a pilot flying manned or fully autonomous via AI. This allows high-risk missions without endangering air crews. More crucially, the Raider is an invisible command hub 
linking satellites, drones, and ground forces in real time. Imagine a battlefield HQ in the sky, orchestrating an entire campaign while undetectable to the enemy. The B-2 could carry 18 tons of weapons, but raw volume no longer defines power. The B-21 carries about 9 tons, but each munition is exponentially more precise and destructive. Modern smart bombs can hit targets within centimeters, eliminating the need for massive arsenals. The Raider can deploy precision, guided bombs, long-range missiles, and even 13-ton bunker. Busters capable of destroying fortified targets buried hundreds of meters underground. For nuclear missions, it carries B-61 and B-83 bombs and new long-range nuclear cruise missiles. Its open architecture allows rapid integration of new weapons, ensuring America stays at least a generation ahead of adversaries. The B-2 program collapsed under runaway costs, delivering just 21 aircraft. The B-21 learned those hard lessons. At 692 million per unit, less than a third of the B-2, the Air Force plans to acquire at least 100 Raiders, ensuring cost efficiency and sustainability. The first B-21 flew in November 2023, kicking off a rigorous test campaign. By 2025, three prototypes have flown, meeting or exceeding classified expectations. Low rate production has begun, backed by a 4.5 billion supplemental budget. Unlike the B-2, which required specialized hangars, the B-21 operates from standard global bases. Initial operational capability is expected in the early 2030s a record pace for such an advanced weapon. For China and Russia, the B-21 Raider is a nightmare. Beijing has invested billions in radar networks, long-range missiles, and anti-access defenses. Yet the Raider's 360 degrees stealth renders them near useless. Even the most advanced missiles can't hit what they can't see. Moscow faces the same dilemma. Its vaunted S-400 and S-500 systems, billed as the world's best, are blind to the B-21. This creates deterrence through dominance. Knowing America can strike their most secure command bunkers at any moment, adversaries will think twice before reckless actions. The Raider doesn't just deliver power, it reshapes psychology. Enemies must live with the constant fear of an invisible force, always ready, always watching, and untouchable. The B-21 Raider isn't just America's new bomber. It's a promise that freedom will always be defended. If you're proud of this leap forward, show your support with a like, subscribe, and comment with the number one to let the world know where you stand. Every interaction spreads the message. America still leads, America still dominates, and America will never surrender the skies. Join our patriotic community today together. We uphold the spirit of American strength.